good morning. So, got my hot chocolate. So I am ready for whatever we're doing today. So, on to what we're doing today. We are going to be taking out all this hay. We have a load of 75 that's going to one of our horse farms. And then after that, we are gonna be taking all of the hay out. So we're taking all of that out and we're gonna be putting it onto our trailers just so that it's out of our way so that we can get to, you know, finishing leveling the barn. So let's get to doing that, I guess. All right, so Alex is getting this loaded. So 75 bales, that is five bundles. Sir, 15 bale bundles. Uh-oh. What? To fix that, okay. So specific. I definitely know what that is. What am I fixing? Yeah. And they also, if you want to like, like. Yep. Okay. Sure. Ah, uh, so this, these bales fell out of this bundle. Thank you, Aspen, for showing me which bundle it is. Um, so I've got to get those back into the bundle so he can grab those. So, be right back. All right, so that's all fixed. And he's got it. Now, I'm assuming I'm gonna have to pull up all of these pallets, which is so fun. I love moving pallets. Um, not really, like, at all. It kind of sucks, but I guess he needs two more bundles, so yeah, I'm gonna have to think about these pallets. All right, be back. So while Alex is getting the last bundle that we need, I'm gonna get the straps ready so we can strap this down tight. And we usually use two of these red ones and then a yellow one, but the other red one, the bolt came off. So we can't like hold the strap in. So we're not gonna use that one, but we're still gonna use the red strap. So we are, we got a lot of colors going on, which is, you know, Fine. We also have pink straps, which I really like, so I'm just gonna get these up here. So I'm ready to put them on, and of course, I parked myself directly in all of the mud, so that's fun. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get all these straps ready. Things were going good. We were getting everything on the trailer, right? So we got five bundles, no, six bundles on. And we got the rest of our fourth cut on the wagon, but it just started to rain. <laughs> so we've got to get it all back inside really quick. And I also want to call the babies back over because they don't have a barn to go in over there. And it's going to rain is like seven. They're way out there. They're like all the way out there. It's a good thing they're listening to me. Here they come. They gotta cross the stream that goes across here. Come on girls! Aspen is a little upset that I am, you know, talking to other animals. So we'll send her out there. <laughs> come on girls! They're coming. I don't know once they come in. Should be 14. Um, yeah, I mean, should be 14. Come on girls! Oh. You are so muddy! Oh my 
my goodness. So muddy. All right, come on, girls, come on. Go in, go in. Hi, Shirley. No, go into the barnyard, please. Come on, Adelia, go into the barnyard. Last one. Dino and Martha had me scared. I only counted 12. Come on, girls. Come on. Get in the barnyard, please. Aspen, just go away. Here, Aspen. Aspen. Come on. Come on, Wendy. Go to the barnyard, please. Go, Sunfish. Go, go, go. Go, girl. Come on, girl. Should I feed him now? All right, we're gonna feed them now. So they will come in. In the barn or just in the bunk? <sighs> Whatever I'm feeling. Yeah, Dino and Martha were the last two. Oh, hi, America. <sighs> All right, we are back from lunch. Um, as soon as we kind of got home and we're done eating lunch. The weather changed and now it's like not gonna rain until four. So we're gonna get this done while we can. So he's getting all these bundles on there. Um, how many does he have? 15, this will be 16. <laughs> so we're 16 there and then our fourth cut, we got five bundles of that, it's on that wagon. So, while he's doing that, I am inside kind of picking this stuff right here because this was all piled up to like here of just this dirt. And you know, I'm just, I'm finding some random stuff. Don't really know what this was to. Um, but so I'm just gonna kind of go along this edge because over here it's super built up and on the other side it like dips in. And that's where we lose a lot of bundles where he can't grab them because the grabbers it just can't. So I'm gonna fix all this stuff. It's got like mounds of dirt and stuff, so all from the groundhogs. So thank your local groundhog for giving us all this work to do, I guess. So um yeah, so there's three, six, nine, twelve, thirteen more bundles left that he's gotta get onto that trailer. And they should all fit, I mean. Should, right? That is so it's, yeah. They should all fit. Um, he's probably gonna do one more layer and then maybe put some on the other side of that wagon, but I ask. Him. We've got to check to make sure they're good. <laughs> yeah, this. It's a rock star. <laughs> he said he's Spider Man. Um, but yeah, and then after we've get all we've gotten all those bundles up, there's pallets under those ones because we were kind of running out of plastic, I guess. So we're gonna pull up all those um, pallets, with the little pallet forks here, and we're gonna get that done, and then get to really leveling this place. He wants to kind of take out some of this dirt, and we have a hole that we're gonna fill it with, and then take out this pile of chaff right here, which is it looks like it's mostly. I don't know, it's like a mix of chaff and dirt. But we want to get all of it out of here because, I mean, you can see the dust that he's kicking up just from driving around. And even when you're walking around, it's like kicking up a lot of dust. Look at that. Look at all that dust. Look at all that dust. Hello. <laughs> it's awful. Hello. <laughs> so we're going to get all this out of here. We're gonna get a nice layer of just like, I think he wants to buy straw. I'm um, not really sure where we're gonna get that, but <laughs> but yeah, oh my gosh, this is bad. We kind of fixed this up before we put all the, um, geez, um, all the chaff down, but 
Well, oh, Mr. Groundhog, uh, if you're in there, screw you. Yeah, I mean, we've got, like, what the heck? We've got grass growing in here. That was just, the roots are coming in from out there. And then we've got, like, mice roots down all in here. So that all has to go. There's another groundhog hole right here. What the heck? So it's just so annoying. So we're going to get this all out of here. And hopefully we won't ever have to do it again because it'll be level. But I'm sure we'll have to do something again because these groundhogs are just not going away. So, all right, I'm going to get back to um, doing the sides here and we'll be back. So I just finished. Um, it honestly looks much better now than how it did look. And honestly, like some of this stuff looks like it's moist. So it's a little, it makes me a little nervous because I mean, this just doesn't look very good um but it's all leveled out for the most part um and he just grabbed that last bundle on that set of four uh, pallets over there so yeah it looks good it looks good so i'm gonna start cleaning up these pallets never seen this place like completely empty it's weird so i'm gonna clean up there's four pallets right here a bale bro two bales actually broke so cows are eating good tonight we got some nice second cut i'm gonna pull up these stack them here then i'll grab all of them with the tractor once we're done and then we're gonna drag this thing out and um see what we can do with that Okay, so we got all the pallets out. Well, up, now they're in these piles. Alex is coming back to pick up the second pile. So now I am taking this chaff, putting it in one big pile so we can bring it to the freestall. So the cows can pick through it, use it as bedding, whatever they wanna do with it is up to them, I guess. So I'm gonna get this in piles. Then he's gonna come through with the bucket on the tractor and get it out. And he's coming back now for the second pile of pallets. Oh boy. Okay. It's not working. It's not working. This thing's too old. Doesn't even, you can't even use yeah, modern it technology on it. it. Just needs some work. Yeah, definitely. Tell us if you want it. If anyone wants it. Uh, we can't sell it. Why not? 
It's, yeah, if anyone wants a lawn ornament. Um, we can put it in our front. Because we don't have one. Um, we are getting this thing out of here. The tires definitely don't have air, but that's all right. Um, this is also how we are getting it out. the hole but we're getting this thing out of here I've never seen this thing move I just have so many chains on the back that's weird but I vote that this thing goes to scrap but Alex doesn't appreciate that well, that's that might end up, end up oh oh I got it this thing hooked up. All right, we've got it hooked up. Wait, why is he, oh. What? Nothing. I thought he was putting it back. That would be very silly. No, we gotta figure out where we're gonna take this thing. Oh, that's been fired. Which is good, because she has way. energy. It's not good. Yeah, why does this thing have like chains dragging? Like they're they're on there on purpose. Like is this what the um this this is the technology? That's crazy. Oh, we got